Kontabai and welcome to Curacao. As you can see, we're in an island that didn't only receive us with its beauty, but also with its people. One of these people was Roy, a Boy Scout leader and campground facilitator. We had the opportunity to help around the, around the clip campground, cleaning and maintaining the field. Roy's intention with the camp is to connect children with their parents as they learn more about the creator through his creation. Uh, it's beautiful just to yeah, work together with locals. Uh, for me, especially since the guy spoke Dutch and is a very kind man, taught us a lot about nature and stuff and I definitely feel like we blessed this guy by the practical work we did but we've also been blessed by him. It's been a very uh, in nature, humble, uh, work with your hands, hands on kind of day. Very nice. After work we gathered around the fire to sing God's praises and pray together. As Christians we believe that prayer is powerful. So we decided to travel around Curaçao to its key places to pray for the people of this nation. We left Curaçao in God's hands and asked for His blessing upon the island. On Logos Hope, we're taught to be flexible in all circumstances. We've had to put that into practice. Because the coronavirus pandemic meant the island went into lockdown, we had to change our activities and outreach. When we had to be isolated, we focused on worship and prayer. We spent Easter in Willemstad. Crew members perform a play that encourages us to remember Jesus' sacrifice on the cross to offer our salvation. Next, it was time for the ship's annual maintenance period. To allow space for all the necessary work to happen safely, most of the crew members disembarked to join projects in communities around the island. The technical team on board worked with the shipyard contractors on many projects from the engine room to outer decks to deep cleaning and overhauling the ship. They also connected with crew members on other ships in the dockyard and were able to share their faith as they built relationships and visited each other's vessels. Meanwhile, teams spread out across the country to join church and community initiatives while following COVID regulations. Pastor Lucas, Youth Center Monte Carmelo, Team of 24. Roy, Ronda Clip, Team of 20. Gino Borst, Gino's House, Team of 4. Pastor Richard Peng, Agape Community Center, Curacao, Team of 6. One team of 24 people worked in the Youth Center Monte Carmelo Church, which reaches out through different activities. My team is doing decoration for the vacation Bible study that will happen in June. We are expecting free camps and a lot of children. Despite not having enough materials, the group was resourceful and produced arts and crafts out of plastic and cardboard. We are making a train and a train station. We took recycled materials that we found. This is a baby bed, an old baby bed. This is cardboard and we painted a little bit. As you can see, there is like an oil bucket. So yeah, we took everything and recycled, painted, and now it's a really nice train. At the same time, another team helped to build a roof. I'm excited to see when the people come to church and see the roof completely built. And talking with Pastor Lucas, they told us they has been waiting for around two years to build the roof. And now, even though in this global pandemic uh, season or situation, we have the blessing to be here serving, even though the church is in lockdown. So as we are wrapping up, it's been so exciting to be coming alongside this church with the ministry that they have been doing so far for the young people of this island. And we are looking forward to see how this church will continue impacting the young people of Curacao. These were just a few of the activities our crew members were happy to get involved in around Curacao and God was at work through us to bless people as well as to teach and grow our crew members. Thank you for following the work of Logos Hope. We'll keep you updated on how God uses the ship's ministry in the Caribbean region. Pick us up in our next island stop.